Good morning, my lovelies. So, I am waiting outside of the rest area, but there aren't that many cars leaving yet, so I might have to wait a while. Maybe it's a bit too early. I mean, it's not that early. It's like 9.30ish. Um, but I guess on this motor motorway there aren't that many cars stopping at the rest stop. Um, I hope I can get a truck. Please. <laughs> no. So I'm trying to head to Köln and hopefully I'll be there by sometime this morning before noon if I'm really lucky. If I'm not so lucky then probably early afternoon. And then in the late afternoon, before it starts to get dark, I'll try to hitchhike to Bad Marienburg. Um, if I'm lucky, I might get there, but I really don't know, because it's like a small village off the main highway. So, I don't know how big it is or anything, so uh, we'll see. Alright, that's today's update, and... Um, Good morning from Germany. No, I'm going to Switzerland now. I live in Switzerland. Are you Swiss? <laughs> uh, no, I'm originating from North Germany. Really? Okay. Visiting my family. Oh, okay. Cool. Now you're going to Switzerland? Yes. Home. Okay. Have you lived in Switzerland for a long time? No, no. No? <laughs> Just one week. One week? You moved to Switzerland one week ago? Yes. Oh, okay. How do you like it so far? Which country you mean? How do you like Switzerland? I live there. I know, so... Yes. You of like it? Yeah, <laughs> <You know? of> <laughs> okay. I'm married there, you see. Oh, really? I've been there since a long time, many years. You lived since in Switzerland? You lived in Switzerland since 1966. That's right. Wow, that's a long time. Yes. <laughs> I lived in Geneva for 30 years. Uh huh. And afterwards, near Basel. Oh, okay. Oh. But you're from North Germany originally. That's right. Okay. Where in North Germany? You know Bremen. Bremen, yes, I know. Okay. Well, they were there. Two days ago. Oh, okay. I see. Because I like the old town and so on. Uh huh. Oh, okay. The cool. Oh, and what is your name actually? I didn't ask. My name? Yes. My name, no, no, it's a very strange name. It's Horst. H O R S T. H O R S T. Horst. 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 Jürgen? Jürgen. 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 Okay, Jürgen. And uh, uh, Sie wohnen in der uh, nee. von Köln? Nein. Oder? Mein ah. Vater wohnt da. Ah, okay. Ich war dahin mit Vater besucht. Aha, okay. Oh, ja. Heute ist Sonntag. Ja. ja okay. Mhm. Ja. Aber Sie wohnen hier, oder? Äh, in der Nähe Sie? von Osnabrück. Osnabrück, ja. Okay, ich, ich weiß, wo ist. Osnabrück. <lacht> äh, Raststätte Dammer Berge. Ah. Sagt er das? Das ist eine Raststätte, ist eine, über die ja. Autobahn. Ja, ja, ja. Da, aus der, genau da aus der Gegend komme ich. Ah. Gibt es gibt einen anderen Radbus wie jetzt? Ah, der von Köln. Ja? Ja. Okay. <lacht> Kurz vor Köln im Kremscheid ist ein Radbus, da kann ich nicht mehr auslassen. Okay. Urlaub in Deutschland? Ja, und wie heißt Ich bin der Peter. Pe Peter? Ja, aber Peter. Ja. Okay. Ja. Und äh, Sie wohnen in Köln? Nein. Ja. Ich wohne in Ennepetal. Aha. Ich bin am Weg Richtung Schweiz zum Arbeiten. Oh. Oh, so Sie gehen nach Schweiz? Ja, aber ja. Oh. Okay. <lacht> Aber heute ist Sonntag. Heute ist Sonntag, ja. ja. Ich bin ja morgen an Arbeit. Ah, oh, in Schweiz. In der Schweiz. Okay, das Jetzt fahre ich heute schon da runter. Aha. Dann kann ich die Nacht besser schlafen, als wenn ich die Nacht war. Bin den ganzen Tag unterwegs, also die Nacht ja. und den ganzen Tag. Und dann ist die Nacht. Okay. Ah.
Zeit beginnt. Es fängt von vorne an. Ich lass es hinter mir. Lass los, was ich nicht ändern kann. Ein neuer Tag beginnt. Ein Tag für frischer Schnee. Ich hab noch nichts kaputt gemacht. Ich geh. Ich werde sein mit Lauf. Deine Tafel. I can walk more than a kilometer or maybe two kilometers maximum and then after that I really don't know if I can do it. I also fell and I think I might have sprained my left ankle which kind of hurts right now um, but it's nothing too serious. I'm hoping I can get out of here by nightfall. All right. That's it for the update for now. And once I get into a car, hopefully soon, I'll give you guys another update. Bye. Damian. Damian. Yeah. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Okay. You remember some English. Hmm? You remember. Uh, I was working in England for oh, really? uh, three years in England. Oh, okay. And then for four years you didn't use English? No. Mm. Yeah. Also, well, I'm also not uh, German, I'm from Poland. Uh, really? Uh, You're from Poland? Yeah, I live here in Germany. How long? Uh, four years. So. Really? Okay. But you can speak German better than I can, I think. <laughs> well, maybe, uh, I'm working with German people so, uh, all the time. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Where in Poland are you from? Uh, middle Poland. Middle Poland. Yeah. So, 100 kilometers from Warsaw. So, what about you, Heiko? Where do you live? <laughs> uh, one hour from Cologne. Oh, okay. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I know. What are you doing here in a village? Uh, <laughs> Country road. <laughs> spend the night today. I get my very own large room to myself. It's like a guest room, I guess. Um, I'm staying at uh, Patricia's place in Bad Marienburg. Patricia, uh, if you guys read my blog, um, is the super young grandma that I met in uh, Umil. She's the one who's like, said she was 50, but I thought she was in her 30s, <laughs> who was going to the rock festival in Umeå. So she said that if I passed by Germany, I could stop by her place. And her house is super nice, actually. Um, super modern. It's like, decorated in a way that's very, very modern. I feel like it's kind of how I would decorate my home if I had a home, <laughs> if, my ha if I had my own place. So yeah, this is where I'm going to spend the night. Um, yeah, I might stay here until tomorrow to do my laundry and things like that. And then I guess I'll eventually head off to France after. It would be nice to explore, it would be nice to explore the, uh, the village somewhat if I can get a chance. Alright, so I'm going to call it a night. I've taken a shower already and I think it's time for me to get some sleep, like really good sleep in a real bed without any lights or anything, so or noises or anything keeping me awake. So good night to everybody. I uh, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Good night. I have to add that people in villages are so nice. I was at the uh, gas station shop waiting for Patricia, and the store owner. Um, I was actually super hungry, so I wasn't sure exactly when she would come. So I could smell like this delicious bread coming from the store so I walked in and I was looking at this um, piece of bread and uh, it was 75 cents euro cents so I was like hmm, debating whether to buy it or not and he gave it to me for free <laughs> so I was about to like sacrifice my 75 cents and then he was like no oh, it's a present you can have it and I was like, what? Super nice. So, super friendly. Yeah, so now I have a free piece of bread. <laughs> but, um, not that I really am hungry or anything, because uh, Patricia's boyfriend, Jürgen, cooked like a really good meal. And I'm super full now, but just had to get that out there. So, yes. Hmm, German villages. You should visit sometime. <laughs> They're really nice. Okay, so, good night for real now. Bye!